Hey, fun fans. To get the word out about First Choice, our friends at Animark have provided a sweet giveaway of a snowblower motor with hex output. To enter, be a YouTube subscriber and let us know in the comments which product you'd like to see in round two of First Choice. You can enter on any video that has this intro and our winner will be announced on the fun Discord after December 3rd. So make sure you comment below. First Updates Now videos are brought to you by Stryker. Discover why so many first alumni and mentors are putting Stryker first when it comes to their careers, internships, and co-ops. Visit careers.stryker.com forward slash first to learn more. Starting out with Nick Jr. 4130 uh, asking, uh, are there going to be uh, more items added for round two of first choice? And would we might see the Falcon 500s at all? Uh, I can officially say yes, there will be more items in first choice round two. That's about all I can say. That's all I know. <laughs> We're not sure about the Falcons yet. Okay. All Very right. Cool. Uh, so, and uh, Marshall, I know you kind of uh, answered this a little bit, but maybe uh, if there's anything else you guys want to add on here, uh, uh, Cat321 from Team 3739 uh, asked, does Jerry and Marshall think the team should be choosing their items based on last year's updated <sighs> bomb rules for the upcoming 2020 season? Um, I, You know, I, I'm going to answer this as dispassionately as I can. Uh, if it affects your team, if you think it's going to affect your team, take that into consideration. Uh, if not, get the parts and tools that are important to you, and you should be doing that anyway. I'd say if you got some kid who really likes statistics and, and he is just bored out of his gourd, have him run through all this and try to figure out all of this, why, what works with what and why you should have what where. I, mm. yeah. There you go. Otherwise, yeah, like Marshall, wait on it till later. All right, very cool. Uh, just want like to pull in your robot later, right? Yeah. <laughs> Deal with it later. <laughs> uh, Jerry, I just want to get your opinion because Nick Lawrence already did answer this in uh, Chief Delphi, but uh, Richard Wallace from 3620 did ask, uh, was uh, Nick Lawrence work designing something new uh, in regards to useful parts that can be made from fuel? And uh, a follow-up question from Connor is, can it serialize? You know <laughs> I honestly have no idea. If he answered that, I, I missed I, what his answer was. He said I no. Can, <laughs> I, can answer, I can answer that fuel does indeed not serialize. That, that was a problem. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I'll agree <laughs> with that one. Uh, very cool. Uh, and, and we might take a couple more questions, by the way, but we're going to kind of wrap up uh, through here pretty quick. Uh, we have AM Boy Scout uh, says, for Jerry, any idea when Annie Mark might have the limelights again? Oh, jeez. Ouch. Um well, I'm, I, I believe it's going to be, what, what's the website say? That's what I'm going to base it off of, because I honestly don't. We, we, I'll uh, take a look. If you want to actually contact them for us and say, hey, why does Animark not have limelights? Um, feel free to. It says estimated back in stock January 6th of 2020, so January 6th. Uh, okay, okay. So we're, that, that last batch we had was the last batch we had for now. So this next one is... I believe we're supposed to have quite a few in for right for kickoff uh, is the is why that date's sitting there. There's a very small chance we have some in before that, but I highly doubt it. Um, real quick, I saw in the chat somebody asked for the URL for my presentation. So it's zebracorn.link, L-I-N-K, slash V-K-O-P, virtual kit of parts, V-K-O-P, 2020. I'm going to put it in chat, and we'll see if that's the correct one. Just off me listening, so let me know if it is. I think so. All right, cool. Uh, Looks like it. Uh, Marshall, we do have a couple questions uh, for you, which I'm sure these are very serious questions. Uh, somebody <laughs> oh, uh, named Frank M. Uh, asked, <laughs> who is Marshall? Uh, that's a good question. If I knew, I'd, uh, I'd answer it. All right, fair enough. <laughs> and uh, uh, uh CMC Bride asked, uh, just Kane Connor, uh, Marshall, how loud are your pants? Uh, very, very loud. Excellent. So fashionably loud. <laughs> and if you guys don't know about zebra corns, please do go check them out. They have some uh, pretty awesome apparel uh, that they uh, wear on here. <laughs> um, uh, so I think for now, that's going to probably wrap us up for questions as we are starting to hit the uh, 30 after the hour. Uh, but definitely appreciate everybody. If we didn't get your question, once again, please type it in our Discord and we'll follow up with either Marshall or Jerry uh, so we can get that back to you. Or you can post it in Cheap Delphi. Uh, either of those work out well for us. Uh, just a reminder, because I have people messaging us, if you win something, please shoot me your first name, last name, email address, uh, and shipping address as well, too, so we can get stuff out to you. Uh, it's hard for me to respond during the show. Uh, but with that said, let's go ahead and draw uh, for our third giveaway here. This one went a little bit quicker uh, than that. And of course, that's going to be uh, we had the uh, encoder and what is it? The mag encoder. And what was the other part of that? 
uh, the the mount. Mount, thank you for that. Um, so the winner of that is going to be, let's see, Redline Disposition, by the way, was a keyword uh, to type in for that. Uh, Wombat of Doom. I like that name. That's not bad. It's so, a good name. Yeah, not a sub, by the way. So I was going to say, it, we'll still say it's rigged. Why not? Uh, so if you're sub, lots of rigged emotes because we didn't rig it for you. How's that? Uh, so type that in. Congratulations, <laughs> Wombat of Doom. Uh, please make sure you reach out to us uh, for is that. Is that one of my Australian teams over there? Hope you I don't mind shipping. <laughs> I'll be um, over there in January, so I can just bring it yeah. with me. How about that? All right, there that's, you go. <laughs> that's that's super cool. Um, and uh, do you want to wrap up here and just uh, go through a couple last things? So, uh, by the way, thank you to everybody who has stepped up support. We got a tremendous amount of support today. I know we haven't been on for a couple of weeks, uh, so I appreciate that. Uh, I'm just going to let you guys know if you are watching. Uh, we're going to have a couple more shows for the rest of the year. Uh, I'm expecting to be a father in just a couple of weeks here, so super excited for oh, that. Hey, okay. congrats! Yeah, man. thank you very congrats. much. Uh, so that's going to kind of dictate a little bit of the scheduling, but so we'll be gone, uh, probably the middle of December, we'll be ready to rock. Uh, we have a couple, probably at least one more show, uh, next week. Um, and then we'll be back in January, uh, over with first capital at the beginning of the year, uh, ready to rock. And we also do have an FTC show next week uh, as well, too, if you want to check that out. So, uh, very excited for that, but let's read off real quick. Who stepped up support, uh, since our last show. So thank you very much to, uh, Lino, uh, for 21 months of support us, the people, Howard, the prime sub red leader with a whole bunch of bits. And we'll read off some of those in fact, player with the prime sub Matt 15, 11, 31, 31 months of support. Holy crap, Matt, uh, C McBride, one, six, six, uh, 30 months support with the tier two sub Connor. Thanks a lot, man. Uh, team, uh, first team three, four, two, uh, gave a tier one sub uh, to Nate. So congrats on that. And thanks a lot, uh, Nate. Red Leader 342 also gifted a tier one sub to Davin 342. So inner team uh, giving subs there. Uh, RP202 with the prime sub. Owen Coyne with four months of support. Uh, says, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Owen. Um, and also 300 bits as well too, Owen. So thank you very much for that. Uh, Data Ninja X with 100 bits. Uh, one of the f a few more randomizer with some bits. Uh, Owen Cohen coming in with another 200 bits. Thank you very much for that. Uh, Red Leader 342 uh, gifting another uh, sub out to the community. Uh, Randomizer 77, Obsidian Jeff with three months of support. Carrie 5266 with the prime sub. Ola Zola 500 bits just a couple of minutes ago. And Red Leader 342 with another 200 bits. Thank you guys for all that support today. Lots of bits coming in, lots of subs. We appreciate you uh, helping us keep fun, loud, live, and independent. Um, and we won't do that Megan Coder anymore. But uh, so, but thank you so much, everybody. It really does mean a lot uh, to us uh, that you are willing to support us. And you know, we do have you know sponsors coming in, but we still need your help uh, to keep this stuff going. And we make this for you. So thank you very much for that. So as we wrap up here, Marshall, uh, kickoffs coming up soon, man. I know, uh, I'm sure you're excited for no longer having stop build. But what's going on with the zebra corns this year? Uh, we're having a lot of fun. Um, we'll have a new white paper out very soon that uh, will detail our exploits with the Jetson Nano and the Andy Mark Tile Runner GTO chassis. Mm, cool. Very cool. And where can they find that? Uh, we'll post it on Chief, and it'll be on our website. So Zebra Corn or uh, sorry, Team Nine Hundred dot org slash Labs. There we go. There you go. Awesome. Uh, Jerry, great to have you back. I know you're uh, doing some traveling, so you're actually calling us from a ho from your travels yep. in a hotel right now. So thank you so much for taking the time for that. I know you got a lot more travels ahead. So uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about what's going on with you and uh, and even Andy Mark? Uh, well, I'd say since I've been doing international distribution, I was actually looking to move out to Australia. So that's actually happening in January. Awesome. Uh, it's not permanent, but it's at least temporary to see if we really want to stay over there. So I'll be over there uh, all next build season. Uh, and then we'll be coming back for champs uh, afterwards. So that should be fun. Very, very cool. Again, good luck with that, man. I know Australia is a, is a, a new home to you, and you've, you've gone there so many times, so can't wait to – hopefully it works out, and hopefully you love it over there. So very cool. Yeah. Um, also, do you want to give a general shout out? I know that not all of you can step up with uh, bits or subs, but we still appreciate you. Um, all we ask that you do is if you're not able to step in that way, or even if you can, please tell people about First Updates Now. Spread the word out there. Uh, we have grown tremendously. We've done over triple the viewership this year than we did all last year already. So uh, we are getting out there, and we can't wait to keep making more great content for you uh, as we go into the 2020 season. So thank you for watching Fun. Don't forget to check out Fun on Facebook or Instagram under First Updates Now. We also do have FTC content under fun ftc uh, we even have a fun latin page on our facebook as well too if you prefer an espanol uh, and you can join over 2,000 people on our discord at discord.gg forward slash first updates now thank you everybody for tuning in we'll see you next time on first updates now talk to you then good night everybody
Thanks for watching. If you want more fun content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. You can also directly help support fun by visiting our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.